Mount Carmel Church, family and friends, uh, Pastor Eric here. I just wanted to uh, share a brief um, thought today uh, coming out of Sunday. Uh, we sang a song uh, called Reckless Love uh, during our worship service, and it's a song that, that means a lot to me. Um, I first heard it when I was uh, in Las Vegas uh, a couple years ago uh, serving as a pastor and uh, had some low points uh, really in my in my life and uh, this was a song that God used to just encourage me and to um, just to help me grow uh, in, in my understanding of his love for me. Uh, it's based on a verse uh, from Zephaniah. How about that? Zephaniah, that's in the Bible, uh, in the Old Testament, uh, a minor prophet. And in chapter 3, uh, verse 17, Zephaniah says this, which is just absolutely incredible to think about the creator of all things does this over his people. It says in Zephaniah 3 verse 17, the Lord your God is in your midst, a mighty one who will save. He will rejoice over you with gladness. He will quiet you by his love. He will exalt over you with loud singing. It, it blows my mind to think that God sings loudly over me. I mean, why, why would he do that? I am so unworthy of that type of love, but God does love us with a reckless love. As you listen to this song uh, that Jordan uh, leads, um, that Jordan led on Sunday, he just did a wonderful job uh, capturing the, the emotion that, that comes uh, with the words. There, there's a point in the song in, in which it, it sort of slows down and, and it says, these types of things that that there is no shadow that you won't light up talking to God there's no shadow that you won't light up you are coming after me there, there's no mountain that you won't climb up you are coming after me there is no wall that you won't break down you are coming after me. There is no lie you won't tear down. You are coming after me. That that's God in his reckless love for us, for you, my friend. There is nothing, absolutely nothing, that will stand in his way of pursuing you, of coming after you, and singing loudly over you. I mean, you may be watching this video and, and you're at the lowest point in your life right now. Maybe you've turned to, uh, to alcohol, prescription pills, and you're just there in your and your place and it's dark and you feel so hopeless this God will light up that darkness this God will tear down those walls of addiction this God will climb up any hill any obstacle because he deeply cares for you and if we ever ever doubt that we just simply go back to the cross 
where Jesus climbed up a mountain and he sacrificed himself and he died for you because he deeply loves you. This God does not give up on you. And it's proven in his love for you displayed on the cross. It's proven that when he was dead for three days and in a tomb, that he crushed that rock wall and busted out of the tomb and resurrected. And he's coming after you because he loves you. So take a couple moments and listen to this song and in particular, pay attention to what it says. And may God encourage you today with his reckless love.
shadow you won't light up Bouncing you won't climb up Coming after me The snow wall you won't kick down The fly you won't tear down Coming after me The snow shadow you won't light up Bouncing you won't climb up Coming after me The snow No!